welcome back to my channel i hope you guys are all doing super super well hello if you are new to the channel and you've never seen my face before my name is Rekha and i'm actually going to uni this month to study primary education with qts so this is basically gonna, <laughs> gonna be a video showing you guys all of the stuff that i've picked up for my university room i have got an ensuite room so i am going to be buying stuff for my bedroom my kitchen and my bathroom and i'm going to study primary education with qts which is a qualified teacher status in birmingham so i'm so excited to show you guys all the stuff that i've picked up if you are new to the channel and you've never seen my face before please make sure to subscribe down below to my channel don't forget to give this video a massive thumbs up i do post on my channel every three days that's a lie <laughs> that is a lie i post on my channel every two days and obviously i'm going to be going to uni so there will be so many different uni vlogs coming up weekly uni content showing you guys a moving vlog a room tour so many other exciting uni videos coming super super soon on my channel so make sure to subscribe down below this is actually a part two of my uni haul so if you haven't checked out part one go and check it out i posted that literally two days ago so yeah go and check that video out i've actually posted a couple vlogs going to ikea showing you guys a uni shopping vlog so go and check that out and also when i went to bnm bargains as well so subscribe for more university content but yeah i'm so excited i will be vlogging weekly um showing you guys what i get up to in the midlands so it should be super super fun can't wait to take you guys all along with me be sure to follow my socials as well i'll put them on the screen um but other than that oh, let's get into the video because there's a lot of stuff to get through and i can't actually physically do this i'm gonna put my phone on silent because yeah stay tuned get a drink subscribe <laughs> um okay so low-key random but the first thing i've got is just this actually do you know what i'm gonna do i'm actually gonna show you what my floor looks like i have been prepared for uni honestly since about june and i'm just gonna freaking show you guys can you guys see that that's what my floor is looking like right, right now um yeah <laughs> i don't even know what to say there's nothing else for me to add my floor is just filthy in my room right now let's talk about it okay so the first thing i've got to show you guys is just this makeup mirror i just picked this up from bnm and it was seven pounds i will mention the prices and the places that i got the items from just so that it is a little bit helpful but i will need a mirror to see my makeup in and i'm not going to take this freaking cracked mirror because i dropped this on the floor over 1000 times so this is actually going to stay at home but i'm going to take this one with me because i do need a replacement and obviously the back side is just magnified and the front side is just like a normal mirror i have got some kit kitchen foil just because i feel like this is something that i'm gonna forget and it's gonna piss me off and when i mean forget i know i can buy this at uni but it's like if it's my first night i don't know if i'm gonna do a food shop the first night and stuff like that and even if i do do a food shop i feel like this is something that i could forget so i just picked up some kitchen foil also got some febreze this is literally just for my bed and for like my room just so that the room just smells really really nice these are from bnm they're literally just um like a spoon a spatula and like a pastry brush i don't think i'm gonna need them but I love them just because they're pink. They're three pounds, super, super inaffordable. And you guys would have seen in my previous haul video for uni that I picked up loads of different utensils and stuff from Ikea as well. But I just think these are so cute because they're pink. And I am going for like a pink themed room. Um, very, very typical, I know. <laughs> but I just really want to incorporate pink because my room right now is like white and blue but i just want to go for something different at uni just so that i have two different spaces and stuff like that so yeah i'm going for the pink theme at uni i also saw these which i thought was just really cute they're literally just like some fake roses i think i got these from home bargains i can't remember how much they were but this is honestly just a decor piece but cute right i think it was like two pound like not that deep so these are the pillows that I picked up. These again were from B&M. I think these were eight pounds, I wanna say. I don't really know, but I think just to go, yeah, eight pounds, just to go like on top of my bed, I've got like some white and some pink bedding. So I think that this on top would just look really, really nice. It's honestly just basic, but the quality of these are actually really, really nice. 
and I think I'm just gonna stick to a pink and grey theme throughout the whole three years I'm at university so yeah super super cute and affordable and really really thick because I really hate when like I lay on decor pillows and they just like they just sink like these are super super thick so i'm really really happy about these also for my makeup i just got like little um plant pots these are from ikea i have some right now and they're a lot bigger i don't know why they've made them so small but i think two's enough i'm gonna i'm not gonna take my whole makeup collection not that i can even collect makeup but i'm just gonna take a couple stuff and i think two pots will be enough for like makeup brushes and stuff also from i don't know where i got these from whether it was from b&m or home bargains but they're literally just like some scrubby stuff i don't really know i think you're supposed to use them to clean i generally don't know but i just thought they were pink and cute so <laughs> i don't really know i just honestly i saw all of the pink stuff and i just said yeah give me give me <laughs> i don't know this again was from home bargains you'd have seen this in my uni shopping vlog um i saw this actually on another girl's haul on youtube and i just thought this was such a sick idea but obviously whenever it's my period and it's that time of the month i am on freaking medication blast and i need like a box to store all my medication whether it's my contraception or my neurofen my paracetamol my ibuprofen all that good stuff i thought that having just a box to keep all my medicine in would be really really nice i know a lot of people talk about freshest flu and stuff like that so again just having a box where all my medicine is i think would be really really helpful i am a very very organized person i like to have all my stuff in one place so knowing that all my medicine is all in here would be really really helpful and again super super cheap from home bargains and it's just such a pretty pink color they had this in like a sage and a gray thought they were just really nice so got these my mom actually picked me up some towels and she said that she got these from costco's now you don't really need freaking towels i think these are calvin klein you don't need calvin klein towels okay let me just tell you that but she picked them up actually funny enough they were actually very very affordable from costco i think that was like 10 pounds which is not that bad but yeah super super nice calvin klein sheet um bath bath sheet that's what i'm trying to say um this one is basically like a yellow and a white they kind of look like beach towels i'm gonna be so real but the first one is just a yellow and white one super super big because i hate when towels they're not big enough to cover your body like that is just a fear that i have and like i think she knew that so she got the biggest freaking towels ever and then this one is also just like a pink and red one i think pink and red honestly look so nice together and it just kind of says calvin klein all over it but yeah i haven't picked up any smaller towels i don't think i'm gonna need them like i know a lot of people get like hand towels but i've just picked up two body towels i think that'll be fine um i do obviously have like face cloths and stuff but i haven't picked up like hand towels because i'm not that freaking bougie like i'm so sorry i'm not that bougie but i think two towels should be fine like if one's in the wash i can just use the other one so yep while she was at costco she also just picked up me some socks so there's just a black pair a white pair and a gray pair like, this haul is so random but she just got me some socks because i know that i'll probably forget to pack socks so i'm happy that she's got me some and she also got me some comfort um is this fabric conditioner i don't even know what is it fabric conditioner or fabric softener i honestly don't know it's just the stuff that makes your clothes smell nice so she just got me this one from comfort and it is strawberry and lily flavored which again super super nice from primark i got a laundry rag i thought that this would be actually really really nice to have just so that i have this in the bathroom just to chuck all my laundry in my dirty clothes and stuff like that i don't know how big it is it says it's 35 by 40 i don't know if that's big enough i'm not sure but it was five pound from primark i don't know whether to show you guys all the stuff that i picked up for like skincare like is that really a uni haul but I just got some lotion, some E45 lotion. I'll just go over it quick. Some L'Oreal Hydrogenous um, skincare stuff. It's just a moisturizer and some Sanix for my body. Absolutely love Sanix. It's got like zero fragrance, it's super, super natural stuff. Um, cocoa butter. I freaking love cocoa butter. Um, some simple makeup wipes. I love them as well. This is my 
favorite kind of like fragrance body wash. It's just the Dove Pampering one. <coughs> Bless me, oh my God. Wow, getting sick already and it's not even freshes. <laughs> this is just the Dove Pampering body wash. I am just taking this with me because my dad bought me so many body washes from Superdrug and stuff. He said that they were doing an offer in like May. So he just got loads. So I've got four body washes. I think that should last me a really, really long time. And then two moisturizers. While I was at Primark, I also just chucked in my basket a couple bubbles because I know I'm gonna flip bubbles if I don't. Pack them with me right now. So I just got these bubbles. They were one pound. I also got some pajamas because I know that people are gonna pack pajamas and I will do a whole separate pack with me video, but I wanted to get these pajamas for you because I just thought these were so cute and I just can't wait to show you guys. So first, they're just like these pink bottoms with like red love hearts on them. And then the top is again, just like a satin um, like t-shirt. And I just got these in super, super massive sizes because I love my pajamas to be super, super baggy and stuff. Also from Primark, I just got like a soap dispenser and like a toothbrush holder. These were four pound for the dispenser and three pound for the cup holder. And they're literally just marble. I think these are gonna look so nice in my bathroom. Now, most of my bedding is from Asda's. I picked these up super, super early because I knew that if you leave it to last minute, they're not gonna have the size bedding that you need and you want um, for a super, super affordable price. Now, what I done is I listened to my mum because mommy knows best and she told me to get two like duvets and then like as many sheets as possible so i think i've got about four bed sheets like double bed sheets and two duvet covers the reason i got four bed sheets is because you know it's the time of month sometimes you might leak sometimes you might stain stuff with like lotion and moisturizer and i think bed sheets get the dirtiest the quickest so I got a double um, kind of like, what do you call this like material? It's like just quilted. I just don't really care about bedding that much. As long as it's white or it's pink or it's just very, very basic and plain, it's fine with me, it doesn't bother me. Um, so this just comes with like two pillows and the duvet cover. And then I also got this one, which is like a pink and gray reversible one so one side is gray the other side is pink i don't remember how much these were unfortunately but i can't i generally can't remember but yeah this comes with two pillows and the duvet cover also got loads of more pillowcases so i got two i've got a lot of pillowcases but it's really important to change your pillows like that's how you get spots and stuff and we don't want that okay so i got two pillowcases no yeah two white ones these are white as well so that's four in total and then i also got two pink ones as well i've got a lot of bedding but i think it's important too because like you need to change your bedding like every week and what if one week i just can't be asked to change it i don't really know and then i also got like this double fitted sheet again from asda um i do want fitted sheets because like, i hate when my my beds just keep like the sheet keeps falling off it it's so annoying so i got another pink one got some cotton buds as well i think i know that they say it's not good to use these for your ears but i do use them for my ears <laughs> so i just got these i think these are like a pound from primark honestly i don't remember from ikea i got like this like fake plant it kind of is lost its shape a bit because i've packed it obviously but I don't remember how much this was. And I also just got like this, like, it looks, it doesn't look baby pink, but it is baby pink. Um, plant pot for it. I thought this was just look cute. I've got like a shelving unit in my room. And I think having stuff to kind of put on the shelf will look, make it look, make the room look a little bit more homely. So I just got this kind of like spiked plant. <laughs> I don't even know. And then... I also got this plant, which I thought was cute. Again, this is just a, in a gray pot. I put it in. This pot's kind of cuter, I think. And it just will hang off the shelf. Like, I thought that this, like, if it was just on a shelf like this, just hang in, thought it would look cute again. Um, again, from Ikea, it's fake. I'm not gonna get any freaking 
real plant i don't think there's a point because i will kill it and i will be sad but oh my days it's really not in shape and it doesn't look as cute as it is <laughs> in ikea but do you see the vibe anyway i just thought hanging off again a shelf would look cute so from primark i got these kind of shelving units these were how much are these they were three pound each i just picked up three i don't know where this is gonna go it might go in my bathroom for storage i know that whenever i watch loads of other people's uni hauls they always say get storage because you're gonna need it and i made sure to get loads i have a lot of different skincare products and makeup removers and face washes and all that stuff so i thought i might use these for the bathroom or i could use it on the shelves because i think i've got like eight shelves and stuff so just to put these i think would look better like when they're next to each other do you know what i mean instead of just chucking my stuff in the the, the shell straight away so i got three of these they're just like wicker baskets super super affordable from primark and they had like smaller ones or this size but i just got white ones just because i thought these would be best for my room because i'm going kind of with that white and gray and pink theme more bedding these are fitted sheets from ikea um ikea have sheets as well i think these were so cheap in ikea that i was shocked and these are double they're called the Alvida, Alvida, is that what we call them? I don't even know what they're called. If any of you guys do know, let your sis know. But I just got a grey and a white again. So in total, how many how many bed sheets do I have? Three. So that's three bed sheets so far. Three so far. And then I've got one more. This one's from Primark. This little bed sheet, and this was like how much? 650 and this again is pink and white so i think i've got four yeah four bed sheets in total two duvets and how many pillowcases babe how many i think i've got about eight pillowcases whether that's excessive or not i don't really know but i do like to change my pillowcases a lot and my bed sheets a lot and my duvet like so primark and as well i was looking for bed sheets for so long that i didn't even remember how many i bought so i'm sorry about that if it's annoying but got a shower cap from primark i stole these actually from the kitchen i've lost all my lids but i stole a whole bunch of plastic containers just because i don't know i might want to do meal prep or i don't know i just know that people say bring containers and food stuff to store for the freezer and stuff like this so i have just picked up loads from my kitchen cupboard because i don't want to forget these and it's going to piss me off if i know that i have to buy some when i get there so i just got some from the kitchen also got a bath mat from primark this was six pounds they have loads of different colors they've got gray they've got pink i think and like a light brown and a white obviously but i just got white thinking about it now i don't know if that's the best color i should have went for because I don't know what if my feet are dirty then the mat's basically over and i just don't want my floor to be wet so i just got this super super football but actually really really good quality so actually kind of happy about that but actually on to the last couple of things i got this throw from primark this is reduced which i was freaking happy about because it was seven pounds and it was reduced from 16 which is insane but it is the softest thing ever i used to have a fro from dunelm and that was so soft but like i put it in the washing machine and it just destroyed it like it destroyed it completely like i don't know what i done but i got makeup on it so i thought okay yeah let me just chuck it in the freaking washing machine it'll sort it out as we got a washing machine it lost its material it lost its coziness and ever since then i've been upset because they've stopped doing the shade of blue that i wanted and it's pissed me off so now i'm gonna get gray and i just got this gray one from primark can you guys see how soft that throb is like that is insane it's so soft it just feels like i'm freaking stroking a pet <laughs> I don't even know but yeah reduced to seven pound like primark have got some good bugs for uni and stuff so i got this little gray one i thought gray and pink you know that's the vibe and then the last thing that i've got to show you guys in this haul oh no second to last thing i've still got another thing sorry i'm lying um these are some tea towels 
definitely can do a roll. These are four pounds from Primark. Pink, gray and white. Is that not the theme? That is the aesthetic right there. That's the aesthetic that we're going for. I freaking love these. Primark, super, super cute. They are gonna get destroyed. I am sharing a kitchen with only three people, which I think is not bad. I know that some people are sharing with 12, you know, 16. Some of my friends are sharing with 16. 16, oh, I'll take that. <laughs> I freaking hate that. The kitchen is gonna be such a mess. I'm gonna do everything in my power to keep the kitchen clean, but we'll see when we get there and I'll keep you guys posted. But um, yeah, I saw these, I thought these were freaking adorable. And again, it's something that I'm gonna forget if I didn't buy them now. Um, so yeah, four pounds, super, super good. And the last thing is actually pretty boring, but these are just the organizers from Ikea. They literally just look like that. Um, I don't know what, the storage situation is going to be like um, for my uni. I'm not sure. I haven't got there. But stuff like this from Ikea is so scarce when it comes to shopping around uni time. So I made sure to get them early. But again, to organise like, my bras, my pants, my socks and stuff, this would be really, really nice. So, yeah. Honestly, guys, that is everything that I've picked up for you guys. If you haven't checked out part one of my huge first year uni shop then make sure to go and check it out i will link it on the screen right now and also down below in the description box be sure to subscribe to my channel for more university videos as i am going super super soon actually i think on the day that you're watching this i leave tomorrow <laughs> i leave tomorrow which is crazy but yeah thank you so much for watching don't forget to watch out part one on all my ikea vlogs and my bnm vlogs and my home bargains vlogs go back stay tuned watch it subscribe because we're gonna move to uni soon and i can't wait to take you guys all along with me thank you so much if you've got to the end of the video be sure to thumbs it up and subscribe and other than that i'll see you guys in my next video bye